All right, what's going on, y'all? What's going on? Hey, guys. Um, so today I've got some canes. Um, and then I also have some yummy cupcakes right here. They're called, um, it's from this place called Gigi's Cupcakes. And they're absolutely the bomb. So I can't wait to get down on those. Um, I am so hungry right now that I can't even think straight. Like, I... I just been out all day like doing some Christmas shopping I would say last minute but it's at the minute because I didn't only got like one thing for the kiddo and uh, so I had to go and get the rest of the stuff or what have you so oh let me say my grace um let me just eat some because I'm so hungry If you are new to this channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. If you like this video, go ahead and give us a thumbs up. And definitely hit the bell so you know the next time that I'm posting a video. Thank you so much to my um, real ones out there, the people that have been with me since day one. And, well, really everybody is probably since day one. I still don't have a whole lot of subscribers, but we're going to get there. So I thank you. Thank you so much to the people who stayed it out with me. Tell a friend. Share. All that good stuff. And don't forget. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. You shan't be disappointed. All right, so I this is Cane's. Basically, all they sell is chicken fingers and fries. Um, I had planned on getting a cane. Well, I did get a cane yet. That's definitely what I ordered. But they didn't give me two of my chicken chicken fingers. And I'm so upset. Like I will have talked about this before. I'll probably continue to talk about it only because. It's going to continue to happen to me, clearly. I don't check the bag typically when I um, go to fast food restaurants. So, it's guaranteed that something probably is always wrong with my order. And something told me to check the bag. Like, literally, I was looking in the bag. I was like, hmm. But I was so hungry. I was just like, I want to hurry up and get home. So... When I just opened it, mm -hmm, I saw that I only had four chicken ch chicken fingers. Mm. Paid for six. <laughs> it's all good though, cause I got these cupcakes. So, sorry if my lighting is a little off. I was going to turn on the light here in the living room, but it would just, you, would, you guys wouldn't have been able to see anything. I bought this, what I think is pretty cool, um, mukbang plate. I'm going to use for my mook balls, but the reflection off this thing is or well just too bright I'm going to use it today I'm still going to use it but I know I need to find a way maybe like put some sort of color on it so that it doesn't eat up the light like it does or like put some lumen foil on the other side. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. Anyhow, this stuff is so good. By the way, it's so good. I'm so sorry if you are not fortunate enough to um 
taste came. Mm. It was so good. So yeah. Oh, and so that's why I'm a, I'm I am well I'm already dark, <laughs> but why where I where you know the light on me is a little dark just because I was just like turn the lights on in the background and then do that like that. I could have just kept um I probably could have kept it in the canes box, but I wanted to be fancy. I just got this on sale at Macy's. I was looking, you know what, and I meant to go in the thrift store, but I totally forgot. I, I Like, I was making moves today. I'm like, okay, I need to hit this store, this store, this store, because I wanted to be done before people got off work, because I didn't, I took off today. I was like, um, when are you going to go shopping? Or when am I going to have an opportunity to go when I don't have the kid? And I just like I'll go while he's at school. So, oh, uh, y'all. Um, uh, he So, he wanted um, his big thing this year is Beyblades. It's a cane sauce. It's just too bright. My light is just way too bright. That's how it would look like if I hadn't um, turned the, the lights on in the living room. It would have been so bright. It's too bright though. But uh, let's see that's how it looks like. The sauce that eat with you make. But um, she puts mayo. And I'm pretty sure. Now, I don't know for sure. So to me, it definitely tastes like it has mayo in it. But I knew people that worked at Cane's, and they said that it was, there wasn't mayo in there. I like Google name all these these things, these items that we thought were in the sauce, and they were like, "No, it's not. That's not in there." I go find a little thing there. So I don't too much now. But I'm sure what she has probably tastes just like uh, you know, tastes just like cane sauce. If y'all don't know by now, I would love to eat fries with ranch and ketchup at the same time. I knew somebody who <laughs> they dipped everything in the in the cane sauce. No external sauce is needed, which I mean it's that good of a sauce. To me, my dad used to make this um seafood sauce that we would eat with um like fried fish or what have you. And he would just mix ketchup. Was it ketchup and ranch? No, it wasn't ketchup and ranch. I think it was ketchup and mayo. And it's honestly really close or tastes very similar to cane sauce it was just ketchup and mayo and then he would add some pepper and some other seasonings in there boom I used to have well, mostly we I think we ate a lot of perch I love catfish. I've been wanting catfish for a while. I might get some soon. I love. I 
I'm gonna be off work for the next two weeks. Because the kid has um, winter break. And I was just like, dang, well, I don't take him to, uh, oh, I need to, that just reminded me of something. But um, he doesn't go to a daycare anymore, so, you know, when he's out of school, something got to shake. And I could just ask my mom to watch him until I got off work, but I had time to take. If you don't use them, they don't. If you don't use your time off, it does not roll over. So I was like, well, why not? So I will be off until next year. <laughs> but um, I just moved to a new team, and the team that I'm on, we ain't doing nothing. We ain't doing nothing, y'all. So. I don't need to be there. My team ain't, they ain't even gonna be, they definitely not gonna be there next week. Um, I think some people will be in. Uh, <coughs> excuse me, the week after Christmas. But, I don't really know. In the words of one of my dearest co-workers, not my pig, not my farm. She says that often. And it's so funny because um, <coughs> we both just moved um, off of the team that we were on. We were both on the same team and then we both got new jobs or whatever. And um, It's so fun. We're just so oblivious, like, to what's going on with the old team. It's a lot of... It's quite hectic. They're dealing with some real, real life issues. And we just, like, literally not my pig, not my farm. <laughs> I mean, I feel bad for him. You know what I'm saying? Now, she is lucky because she... move to a completely different area so she really doesn't have to deal with it me i'm still in the same area so they could still leverage me if they need to until after this um next quarter yeah i'm free kind of feeling better y'all I wish I could see I didn't even I literally brought stuff in the house I did go to the and look this is my little sticker I tried to take it off but it's gonna be a task that I couldn't do while I was so hung so hungry I washed the plate though it'll come off eventually I didn't even, uh, And you know who else? Um, okay, let me finish that other thought. So when I came in the house, I didn't even put, like, my bags are still sitting by the door. Like, I didn't even put the bags up. I'm just like, I got to eat. 
I went to the Asian market, so there were some things that I needed to put in the freezer. In the fridge. Other than that, I gotta deal with it when I get done. And that's unfortunate because I'm gonna really wanna sit down, but I can't let the kids see what I got. My coworkers asked me, you know, we were we were having like um so my old team we had like this, you know, farewell um, celebratory lunch or whatever yesterday. And um so they were asking everybody for um, me and the girl I was talking about, not my pet, not my farm, we both have little boys. I think her son Maybe her son just turned seven or six. Maybe he just turned seven. And uh, just asking if they still believe in Santa Claus. And her son does. Hasn't discovered the truth, I don't think, yet. Now, mine, he still does, but I did tell him the truth. I had to. <laughs> um, due to some extenuating circumstances, I only had to grow up a little quicker than I would have liked them to. But yeah, and he was he was very shocked and heartbroken. Like homie cried. I told him about everybody, like the Tooth Fairy, the Easter Bunny. And they were just looking at me like, Ooh, how dare you? I didn't want to. It wasn't like he caught me or anything like that, like, but, you know, her time, now, I'm trying to think back to my childhood and when I, um, I can't remember when I stopped believing or when I, I guess when I found out that Santa wasn't real because I think I still believed for a while. I honestly can't remember. I do remember my mom like coming from shopping and like putting um, some toys in the attic in our like in our house. Because I think whose room was in the attic at the time? We like flip flop. Like at one point, my brothers was were their room was in the attic, and then we were in the downstairs ba bedroom, and then I don't know whose room it was, but because it could have been our room, and that's why we were I was up there. And she just brought the bags in, and I looked in there, and I kind of I don't know what I thought of it, and then of course I saw those same presents under the tree on Christmas. Give me, but I don't think I felt no ways about it. <laughs> it should be a crime how fast and how how I tore that food up like that. Um. Yeah, and to this day, like my dad, he still writes from Santa on our presents and stuff. I think it's so cute. I love it. And last year, was last year? No, I think I told him this year. So, this Christmas will be the first one. But he asked me, he was like, can I still believe? And I was like, you sure can. I don't have a problem with you still believe if, believing if you want to or what have you. 
Okay, I might use this cupcake. Okay, so I kind of tried to clear my plate off a little bit. Okay, so first let me take a sip. And another thing about canes, and this is not even the cup that comes with the Caniac combo either. And usually if you get the Caniac, then you get the biggest drink and it's usually a plastic cup. But that's okay because if I don't get the plastic cup, then I'm not inclined to want to save the cup. Okay, um, but Kane's Ice, they have some really good ice. It's very close to Sonic, Sonic's Ice. But I think Kane's Ice is better because Sonic's Ice, I don't know, it get, and maybe that's because it's by the time you get to it, it's in the water. So I wonder what it tastes like in the water, what, in whatever drink you have. But I wonder what it tastes like, like fresh out the ice machine. I guess I could have gave you guys. So this is the cupcake. Mmm. And it's got a nice little cookie at the top. I usually am sing I'm dancing all the time I'm eating. So chocolate chip cookie dough is my all time number one favorite ice cream. And this is a chocolate chip cookie dough cupcake. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Mm. And it's got this icing is cookie dough icing. Mm. And a cookie dough cupcake with chocolate chips in the inside. Mm. I got the kid one. I can only imagine the mess that will ensue. I was gonna eat this chocolate one too with you guys, but I'm a little fool, so. I mean, I'm gonna get this one down. Mm -hmm. But maybe I'll save it for the next video. Because <laughs> I probably ain't gonna eat nothing else today. It's so good. It's really moist. I just love all the flavor elements together and I typically I'm a person who if I get a cupcake and I got this much icing on there I'm scraping all of it off and I just want like a like the thinnest layer of icing on there but it's cookie dough icing I'm still probably not gonna eat all this icing okay I'm just let it come off now oh Top of my cupcake got stuck on there. Yeah, but I was like, when I was, when I had decided that what I was gonna eat, and I thought to myself, mm, dang, I wish Kane's had um, dessert. I oh, man, I remembered that this place was right in, like in the next little shopping plaza over. And I was only going, I don't think I, well, no, I think I did debate, like, I was possibly going to get another flavor if they didn't have the chocolate chip cookie dough, because for a while, they did a thing where they have, and they still do, but um, you can only get certain flavors on certain days, which is kind of cool, because, you know, it's a marketing thing, keep people from, com keep people coming back, or, you know, or even checking back, because, you forget what day they which day they have certain cupcakes. Um, so I I didn't know if they were gonna have um, this one today, but they have this one every day now. So that's good to know. And they have a rewards program. Woo child! My kid says that now. Ooh, child. The first time he said it, I said, where did you get that from? 
knowing exactly where he got it from but like how and he said it in perfect context and i was just like how do you know how and when to say that you know kids amaze you like that don't they it's just like they pick up everything they're little sponges it was for it was um for a while i had to watch everything i said around him because i still do clearly but Uh-huh. I don't think the last couple of times I got sweet tea, I usually get lemonade if me and the kid are sharing uh, the canes. Oh, yeah, y'all. I'm full now. Could you imagine if I had eaten two more chicken strips? Okay. I feel like I had something else to tell y'all, but... Mm-hmm. Anywho, I may or may not eat the rest of this icing. Anywho, thanks guys so much for watching. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up if you like this video. Um, definitely subscribe, subscribe, subscribe to our channel. Um, and I thought I had a belch coming on. And definitely hit that bell so you get notifications the next time I post a video. And thank you so much for tuning in. We will see you in the next video. Bye.